in keeping with his promise to train and retrain the people of Edo South to Senitura District since he was first elected in 2015. About 7,000 graduates and unemployed youths in Edo South, Senitura District have benefited from Senator Matthew Rokide's training and empowerment program which started in 2016. Most of the beneficiaries were trained and given financial empowerment. Some of the trainees done were in production of domestic products, fishery, snary, weather fabrication, fashion, and more. One of the first set of trainings on domestic products for graduates and other youths across the seven local government areas of Edo South Senatura District witnessed for the first time a legislator presenting checks of 50,000 naira each to over 500 trainees. The senator at that training disbursed over 10 million naira to those who were trained. <laughs> I will be 
Thank you, Bob Bell. Agroforestry, and we are taught a lot of things how to rear snake and some other things there. As you can see, this is my check and one of the beneficiary. Thank you to Senator Matthew Oride. May God continue to bless you. From this three days training, I've gained a lot of things. Like now, I cannot bake properly, which I was having problem with. So and. Now I can also do some other, uh, venture into some other businesses which like snaring and other farming uh, um, uh, products. So I can say this program has really empowered me especially. So it has made me stand out among other people. So it's not just about the certificate, it's also about empowering yourself as an individual. So right now I can't depend on the government, I think I'm self-dependent now. Outside the training I've gotten my check. Uh, he gave uh, the senator, Senator Matthew Roide, gave me a check of 50,000 naira. So right now I'm actually 50,000 naira richer and I'm self-established and I'm going to do my business as planned, as considered by myself. So I'm happy, I'm really excited. May God bless him richly in abundance in Jesus' name. Amen. After training, he gave me 50,000. I've learned how to rest now. We'll be sending representative to Senate the higher chamber in Abuja, but we've never seen a legislator that have done this type of something that Matthew, Isaac Borio, no Rogi, they have done for a uh, 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 senatorial district. So I thank you very much. See me, training, money, and food. He has empowered over 200 people. He trained us and he has empowered us. So I say God Almighty will give him all his heart desire. I've learned a lot. I've learned the soap making, air freshener making, then detergent making and also the cream making. And then the first day we learned this machine repair. I'm very happy to be one of the beneficiaries and I pray to God to elevate Senator Matthew. God bless you, sir. Well, I'm so happy now. Everybody came here for the skills. And now we, we are here with, to empower us with 50,000 era. Well, I want to say we got to continue to bless the senator. I continue to empower him and for him to continue to do this empowerment for other younger ones to call me to benefit on this empowerment skills. I then how to bake cake, how to make liquid soap. I'm so happy. He gave us, he gave us 50,000 naira to start up the business. And so I want to tell the senator that I'm very, very grateful. Um received a lot a whole lot i'm so so happy so excited but this, this is a startup and i believe 
this time next year I will be <laughs> a boss of my own I'm really happy and I pray that God keep him to help more people God really bless him and I appreciate wow I'm so happy and I don't really know how to express my feelings now look at my check 50,000 naira. I'm so happy may God bless this man Senator Matt Yurogide for his kind attendance thank you so much I'm very very happy I've learned a lot for this three days program I've learned how to make liquid soap, how to make air fresher, shampoo, and the rest. In fact, I'm so excited. Do you know the most interesting part? I'll just be giving 50,000 naira check to go and start up. My, I'm so happy. Very, very excited. For the senator, I said God will bless him. In the two terms of four years each, the Senator Matthew Rohidi represented the people of Edo South Senatorial District. His concern was how to train and retrain the people of Edo South, especially the youths, to make them financially dependent. Some of them were given money as starter packs, while others were given a full complement of what they need to start their business. Not less than 222 youths and women selected from the seven local government areas that make up Edo South Senatorial District were in November 2021 trained on several skills and supported with starter kits to commence their prospective businesses made up of mental works, barbing, hair making and fashion. The interesting thing about the trainings done by Senator Matthew Urugidi is that those who benefited got what they needed to start their businesses. For instance, those trained in barbing techniques were given what was needed to start off, including electricity generating sets. All they needed was to get a shop and start the business. normally experience i'm grateful this is no matter of politics from a good will from his own heart for giving me this opportunity to be a salonist today may heaven bless you in jesus name amen Senator Matthew Rogido is a nice person and I thank him very much for the empowerment he gave us today. I want to say a very big thank you to Senator Matthew Rogido for the empowerment program which he has enabled us to, to achieve today. <laughs> I'm just overwhelmed. <laughs> I can't really express my gratitude. Thanks a lot sir. Thank you for everything you've done for us. Thanks for empowering the youth. I believe with this stuff we can at least make something better for ourselves. Thank you. God will bless you. God will give you long life and prosperity. As we wipe away our tears, God will wipe away your tears in Jesus' name. I want to appreciate the senator for this very benevolent act. It's something that is very, very great in this present day and age. So I'm grateful to him and I pray that God empowers him to do greater works. With all those things that he have given to me, it's for me to, do, to rent a shop and start my own life. I'm very happy. May God continue to bless him. In 2021, no fewer than 325 persons were trained in different vocations, again by Senator Matthew Uruhide. This time, the participants were trained in soap making, hand sanitizers, fabric making, and cream production. They expressed gratitude to Senator Matthew Wuruhide for giving them the free training with a promise to start up immediately. I want to appreciate um, Senator Matthew Wuruhide for this empowerment program that he has done for each and every one of us. He tried for the Edo people and uh, God will empower him to go higher than this. We are expecting him to go for After Senator, he will go for so that the training will go around the whole state. I thank the Honorable Senator uh, Rede for giving us an opportunity to learn how to do wedding and our fabrication for starting, yes, which it gives many of us a light to move forward in life. 
Yeah, the training was uh, very nice. Uh, we didn't expect this. In short, I gained a lot from the training. In short, I've been hoping to get this kind of training because when it has to do with fishery, fishing is one of the things that is you know, commonly consumed by men. So I'm glad that I'm here. Our able Senator Rogide, Matthew Rogide, we thank you and God bless you. I appreciate the opportunity to be a part of this program. It really, I, I learned a lot. I learned something new and I'm going to put it to practice. And I say a big thank you to Senator Rogide for the opportunity. God bless you, sir. We learned a lot today pertaining the fishery and how to preserve and um, prepare a fish. Um, we want to say thank you to Senator Matthew Rohide for the opportunity. In another training for mothers held at the constituency office of Senator Matthew Rohide, the women were trained on cosmetology, which includes the production of perfumes, powder, and soap, which was organized by the National Directorate of Employment. Senator Matthew Rohide, I want to thank him for this kind gesture in which. He has to empower our women. I pray God will continue to bless him and grant him all his hard desire in Jesus' name. This time around, I, and I know how to make perfume. I know how to make liquid soap. I can make liquid soap. I can make dusty powder. I can make hair cream. And this person who God has used is Honorable Irohide Matthew, Senator. Our great senator, Matthew, I am so grateful to you. I say the God who have used you to remove shame from our eyes, remove us from begging. Before now, we don't even have food to eat, nothing. Everywhere is dry. But now, I cannot make soap, hair cream. You know, I will go and say, and from today, I, I know I'm not going to hunger anymore. Senator Rohide, God bless you. Thank you for my body. Oh. I want to thank our Senator, where they represent us, Senator Matthew Isaac, Isaac Bonro John Uroide. God, God bless you. This initiative where you can't give us, where you know what make with the bear worker, may God take and guide you. You don't make us, you say you know God, you know what make they give us fish. You don't teach us, don't teach us how to fish. So now we don't they go fish, we they go sell. We don't learn how to do this thing now. Even if we not feed go the market time. Now do I what they use for heart? Now, that money go to enter our purse. We go buy and do what we they take watch our children clothes. They do everything. In giving a sense of belonging to Libya returnees who are of Edo State extraction, another two weeks capacity building training program which held at Ibado, or your state, and facilitated by Senator Matthew Rohide was also a memorable program for the trainees. It was joy and excitement for the participants after the two weeks program on poultry components and confessionary organized by the Ministry of Niger Delta Affairs in 2019 ended in a grand star. Each of the participants were presented with a certificate and a sum of 300,000 Naira transferred directly to their accounts. The training has been encompassing, fully loaded. We're taking to different farms for practicals on how to do all of this. And the most fascinating aspect of it all was the value addition that we are taught in the poultry farming production. For instance, apart from rearing of eggs, we now also discover too that you have other areas in, in the poultry professions that you know are even more rewarding than the, 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 the fowl rearing. You have the feed and the feed milling sessions with even about five value additions. We have the processing of the meat, uh, that is the layers, the boilers and all of that. We also have the, the vaccinations, the, med the medical aspect of it. We also have the consultancy aspect of it. In other words, the poultry, as a matter of fact, have been taught that there are a lot of business opportunity available to this poultry business which has been so interesting to me and other graduates. Frankly speaking, I want to tell you that I'm no longer the same way I came. I have been redefined and as well transformed in the vocation that I have been trained and tutored. And I believe with all sense of humor and leniency that I will transform this very knowledge and skill to the level of also being a provider of labor by the grace of God. Distinguished Senator, I want to thank him for his good gesture, 
he has the intention in empowering youth in his senatorial district and i love him for that he should keep on doing it he's a, he's a nice one in 2021, Senator Matthew Urohidi, Chairman Senate Committee on Public Account, organized several training programs on agro-business by the Forestry Research Institute of Nigeria. Senator Urohidi, who was represented by his aide, Mr. Peter Obame, said the training centered on snail and fish farming techniques and entrepreneurship, which will aid graduates to become self-employed. On his campaign trail, Senator Matthew Urohidi promised that he would continuously, continuously you know, build the uh, capacity for youth, empower them and all that. And since he has, um, since he went into the Senate 2015, he has been doing that, you know. So this, uh, today's training was for 200 people. And you, you remember that in December, we had uh, another training last year, just a few months ago. You know, so he does this every year. Last count on the training is about 6,700 people that he has trained. And he, he continues. And then all through the year he has programmed very many to be done like this. So you can see from the faces of these people that they are very happy about it. They were all trained in, uh, in, a, in, a, in a field that they can use and uh, better their lives. And they were each given 50,000 Naira, which is uh, something that can uh, really encourage them. Uh, by and large, we will do this as long as uh, the God strengthens the senator. He has promised he will do it. He has, he has been doing it and he will continue to do it. The participants said Senator Matthew Rohide gave them a lifetime opportunity to earn a living. They said they would never forget the efforts of Senator Matthew Rohide in redefining proper representation. It's a very good one because it has really given us an experience on how to start up a small business and then not actually waiting for huge money to be able to start up something so and the finance he has also given to us is a very good one so i thank senator matthew rogide for what he has provided for us today senator matthew rogide has been a helpful person to the poor masses like us if many of them have been doing the way he has been doing since he entered from the first year to this moment, I don't I think to have been a better uh, government for us or to us all. We appreciate him for everything. And there is nothing we desire of God that he will not get. Bringing us here to learn so much because I've learned so much really. I've learned when I'm going back home to implement the things that I've learned. I really want to thank him and then I pray that God will place him and enrich his pocket in Jesus' name. Yes, we learned some agro business skills on how to go into agri business of various sorts, whether it's animal or uh, arable plants, whichever you prefer. The business acumen to make sure that when you go into it, you thrive, rather than hurrying into it and hurrying out again. So it was quite a beneficiary one, and we are grateful to the organizer, the senator, Senator Matthew Rogide. In fact, he's quite an exceptional senator. I'm going to use the idea I learned here today to implement it, to make use of it, to earn a living. Staying and depending on the government alone to do it, they can't do it all by themselves, they can't satisfy the whole citizen. But you waking, standing, standing up from your seat and getting up and using the idea you learn here to engage yourself into farming is going to be a very great opportunity for you to earn a living in which you are not going to stay and remain a little bit in, a, in financial stable that you are suffering from. You are going to work towards it now. I'd like to say a very big thank you to great man, a man for the people, Senator Matthew Rokhide, for this great privilege given to us and also for the gifts and everything for the training. He's a wonderful man. And today I've learned a lot concerning agri business. I've learned how to manage business and I've also learned how to take risk in business. Not just to run from risk, but also take it. And through that taking of risk, you will see success. If our senators like this are in Nigeria, are doing the same until the level of uh, unemployment and poverty will go to minimal reduction. This platform he has created he has actually been empowering most people. And uh, I see him as a man, a senator with a difference. He's a man who has a heart for the people. Senator Matthew Rowide has done it again. We are aware of the empl unemployment situation in Nigeria. So getting the skill as a way of taking people out of the employment. And the market is what he's doing. 
I'm speechless. I'm speechless. Like, I want to say a big thank you to Maturo Ide on behalf of myself and my family and the entire body. Say thank you. What he has done today to me, I'm so much impressed. The first time somebody representing Edo South have a direct link with the farmers. So, in, in fact, I'm impressed. I pray that he shall be well with him in all his undertaking. I pray he shall be well with his children. And I, I pray he shall be well with his household in Jesus' name. Others have gone to the Senate in the past, but Senator Matthew Uruhidi made the difference.